Hi, I'm Lauren. I'm so excited to be here with you today. I have a balanced body flow for you. So we'll focus on alignment, concentration, and creating harmony between effort and ease. So let's get started in a seated posture. You can sit kneeling or cross-legged. So whatever is most comfortable for you, just sit with a tall spine and close your eyes down. Let your hands rest naturally in your lap and soften your shoulders down away from your ears. And we'll begin just by connecting to your breath with some even ratio breathing, which is just as it sounds, it creates wonderful balance in the body. So it's a four count inhale, hold for one, a four count exhale, hold for one. I'll take you through a few rounds. So go ahead and close your eyes. Let's just take a clearing breath initially. Take an inhale through your nose. You can open your mouth if you'd like. Big exhale to release. And then taking the breath in through your nose for four, three, two, one, hold. Breathe out of your nose for four, three, two, one. Let's do that again. Hold and then inhale for four, three, two, one. Hold. Breathe out. Four, three, two, one. Hold. One more round. Breathe in through your nose. Four, three. Fill up a lot. Two. Fill all the way up for one. Hold, exhale, four, three, two, one, hold. Awesome, so good. Open your eyes, reach your arms up overhead, take a big stretch. And we'll come down to tabletop position. Come to your hands and knees. Shoulders stack right over your wrists, hips stack over your knees. And we'll drop your belly, look up, cow pose. Take a Big breath in and then round your spine, exhale. Let's do two more of those. Just waking up your spine, breathe into cow, lifting your chin and tailbone, round your spine into cat, stretching your lower, middle, and upper back. One more round, breathe into cow pose, stretching your front body open, and then round it out, exhale. All right, come to a neutral spine and you'll take one leg up behind you, keeping your knee bent. We'll just start with some knee circles, moving around your hip joint a bit. Get a couple big circles going one way and then switch it up. Take it the other way, just getting warmed up into your big major joints. Let's take this into a modified side plank. So you'll stretch your leg out long behind you. Kickstand your bottom leg out to the side and reach your, your arm up. So same leg and arm reaching up. There's a little bit of balance going on right here just because you've got one leg and one arm down. If you need some grounding, you can set your top foot down and stretch. So make this work for you. That's what it's all about feeling good in your body, stretching. Take one more big breath in right here and we'll meet back in cat rounding. So knee and hand come down, go ahead and arch your spine, tuck your chin. Let's take it to cow pose again. Take a breath, opening your chest and heart and then a neutral spine, taking your other knee up behind you, circling, just moving around your hip joint, couple big circles. And then the other direction, you're doing so good. Make sure to breathe with it. All right, and then take this leg straight back. Modified side plank, kickstand your bottom leg, opening up to the side. So again, here, you could drop your foot down to the floor for some grounding. If you wanna play with the balance, lift your leg up. And it's totally okay if you fall out, falling for you. It's what it's all about. It's not about perfection, okay? It's just about showing up and being present in your body. Take one more big breath right here and then round it out into cat stretch one more time. So knees push, palms push, round your spine. One more time, cow pose, opening the front of your body. Take it to downward facing dog. 
take a few rounds of breath just to move and groove in a way that feels good in this first down dog pose. We really get an opportunity to open the back body in down dog. So just feel that, feel your whole back body open and stretch with some deep breaths. It's inviting your whole body to come online really. It's so opening up to the day ahead. Let's take a breath together in through your nose. Open your mouth and let something go. Okay, do that again. Breathe in. Let something go. Anything that's not serving you, let it go. Okay, we'll take one more inhale and then walk your hands to your feet, coming to the back of your mat. Drop your head, soften your knees and roll up to standing. Mountain pose. Take your arms overhead. Take a full body stretch at the top. You know, to start our balance flow, we'll start with floating mountain. So just from right here, start to lift your heels. You don't have to lift them a lot, even just a little bit. You might experiment with lifting them really high. Just see what works. Focus your eyes so you can stay stable. Keeping your heels lifted, we'll take this to fall in angel. So arms drop down. If you can, lift your gaze. It's okay to be wobbly or just being where we are today. It's okay to fall out, falling for you. One more breath in. Forward fold, drop your heels. Good job. Take a halfway lift and then walk it out to high plank. From high plank, squeeze your thighs, push the ground away, take a breath in and lower chaturanga halfway down or all the way to your mat if you'd like. Upward facing dog, open your chest, squeeze your back body. Downward dog, press back. Let's take your right leg up behind you. Bend your knee, stack your hips. Take one more breath in, we'll step forward. Crescent lunge. Okay. So while this is a lunge, it's a strengthening posture, we're also working balance because you're balancing on the ball of your back foot. So feel that. Take a peek down at your feet and just notice if your feet are like really close together and you're walking a tightrope, that's going to be really tricky. So you want width between your feet. Think of railroad tracks under your feet. Okay, arms come up, take a breath. Settle in with an exhale, strong legs. We're gonna take this to airplane pose. Launching forward, okay, chest lifts, back leg lifts. Totally okay with where you are today. Focus your eyes, it doesn't have to be perfect. It's not about perfection, it's about loving yourself, being where you are today. Okay, one more inhale here and we'll step back to warrior two. Big wide stance. Take up space, take a big breath in and a big breath out. You're here, yes. Okay, reverse, warrior, keeping your lunge, but a big stretch to your right side body. Go ahead and extend your front leg, take a breath, triangle, tip down. Stretch your top arm overhead and try not to dip down too low. So we want a really long spine shape here. Think of your spine as just like your back leg. You can even take your top arm onto your back leg and just feel this really long line in your body up to the crown of your head. For a little more intensity, this is totally optional. You can take your bottom arm out and away. Yeah, that's it, you got it. Push your feet into the ground, take one more breath. Standing split. Here's our next balancing pose. So back leg lifts as your head drops. So just enough effort here that you can breathe. You always want your breath to be moving and supporting you. The posture comes second. Hands can stay down on the ground, but for a little challenge, you might wrap one hand around your ankle. You might be able to get both hands around your ankle. Let's see. 
see if I've got it today. I might not, and that's okay, you know, because it's not about perfection. You're doing great. Good. Take one more breath where you are, and we'll take it down to Chaturanga. So go right from high plank to low plank. You can totally come all the way down to your mat. Do what works for you today. Take a breath in up, dog. Good job. Downward facing dog. You'll take your other leg up here. Bend your knee and stack your hips. Just take one really big breath in. And we have crescent lunge on your other side. So whether you did right or left doesn't even matter. It's just the other side from the last. Okay, big reach up, take a breath. And we're just right here for a couple moments to get settled into feeling this as, as a strong shape, but also a balance. Okay, arms can float down if that's helpful. Just focus on the feeling of the ground beneath you, connecting to your breath. You're here, you're present. Focus your eyes, very helpful with balance. Focused eyes. All right, together we'll breathe in and take this to airplane balance. Do whatever makes sense with your arms. I'll often take mine to heart center. Yeah, pull your heart forward. You might expand your wings back behind you. Just do what feels authentic for you. Focus your eyes, super concentrated. Take one more breath. Warrior two, great job. Land right in stability for a moment. Take a giant breath in. Big clearing exhale. Now reverse warrior, keeping your lunge, reach back. Stay for a breath out. And then extend your front leg, reaching back and tip into triangle. So once again, you might keep your top arm just on your body for a moment so you can feel the angle of your back leg. And I want you to create the same angle through your upper body, keeping a really long mountain-like spine shape in your upper body. Gazing up to open your chest. If you want the intensity, bottom arm comes out and away bringing in a little more core strengthening quality. Let's take one more breath. You're doing so good. Take a breath right there. Standing split. Hands come down. Back leg lifts. And you get to do this however it works for you. Both hands can absolutely stay down on the ground and you can breathe here and just enjoy this little upside down moment. If you want to challenge yourself today, try wrapping one or both hands around your standing ankle. Just playing with your balance, that's all it is. It's just play, it's nothing to take seriously. It's just about falling for yourself every day, even if you fall out, embrace it. So good, I'm a little wobbly, that's okay. Here we go, one more breath in. Chaturanga, you're gonna go right into high plank. Moment of strength, chaturanga, exhale, low plank, upward dog. Yes, downward facing dog. Okay, we're gonna go through that one more time. So hands walk back to your feet, back of your mat. Let's take a halfway lift, breathe in. Fold down, empty your breath. Stand up, mountain pose, back of your mat. Here we go into floating mountain. So heels lift a little or a lot. I'm gonna focus my eyes a lot right now to try and stay balanced. What's so beautiful about balancing postures is it demands your presence, right? Like you can't be anywhere else right now. You're just here, you're super focused. Okay, keep your heels lifted, but see, ooh, there it is. Heels stay lifted, it's just as best you can. Arms float down, fallen angel. Shift your gaze up, let your heart open. Yeah, one more breath. Ankles kind of wobbly, that's all right. Fold down, drop your heels, great job. Take a halfway lift. 
Walk it out to high plank. We'll take another breath in plank pose. Chaturanga, it's low push up. Elbows hugging tight to your side. Take a breath in up dog. Downward facing dog. Take one leg up toward the ceiling or sky. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Step into your crescent lunge. We're gonna move this a little more and flow this round. So breath lifts your arms up. Taking it into your airplane balance, taking whatever arms work for you. I'm taking mine to heart center. Lift your back leg, pull your heart forward. Breathe in. Warrior two, big step back. Okay. Keep the lunge, reverse. Take a stretch back. Stay here. Okay, front leg extends now, even more reach back. Triangle landing, keeping your upper body nice and strong. If you want the challenge, float your bottom arm up and open and then standing split. Hands down, you got it. Back leg lifts, just one breath, drop your head. All right, chaturanga, high to low push up. Upward facing, downward dog. Take your other leg up to the sky. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Crescent lunge, rise, take your time, don't rush it. Move with your breath, reach up. Let's go arms float down, just feel the ground under your feet, you're doing great. Okay, balancing, airplane, here we go, move it forward. Use your arms to steady yourself, right? Breathe and focus your eyes. One breath. Step back, warrior two. Landing in stability, reverse warrior. Just a breath out here, feel your feet on the ground. All right, front leg extends, reach back even more. Triangle landing, if you want to. Reach your bottom arm out and away, look up and stretch. Standing split, it's just one breath, so find the power in it. Drop your head, lift your leg. Chaturanga, yes, good job. High to low push up. Upward dog with the breath. Downward facing dog. All right, let's walk your feet up to your hands for a yoga squat. I'm so proud of you. You made it through that. It took a lot of focus, a lot of concentration. So just take a moment right here in your yoga squat. Take your hands to heart center and close your eyes and just really honor yourself for showing up. I'm so proud of you. Falling for yourself every day means showing up for yourself no matter what. Putting yourself first. All right, let's just sit all the way down now into butterfly. So the soles of your feet come together. You can bring your heels in as much as you want for more stretch or keep them a little further forward, more like a diamond shape for less stretch. Just go where it feels good. Sit up nice and tall, take a breath. And if it feels good, you might fold forward. You decide. Just a few breaths here to relax into this shape. All right, with your next inhale, come back up if you folded forward and we'll gently roll back onto your back. As you roll onto your back, just take your legs straight up. Give your feet some love. They work so hard for you every day. Roll your ankles, spread your toes. Okay, and then bring your feet to the ground with your knees bent and try this. Take your arms and stretch them overhead. A really big breath in with me right here. Send it all the way out, let something go. Now you'll lift your hips up, 
to bridge pose. We're gonna move this with breath a couple times. So the inhale's the lift and just a really gentle release on your exhale. If you don't like your arms here, you can bring them down by your side, but do that again. Breathe in, just lift your hips, pushing your hips open and then gently lower them down. So the inhale lifts your hips, keep going. Exhale gently down. Okay, we're gonna come up one more time. We're gonna stay for a couple extra breaths. So come up, stay here. Just gonna take two more breaths. Like I said, if you need to change your arms or bring them down by your sides, that's okay, you're doing great. Okay, one more inhale. Gently release. Good job, bring the soles of your feet together. We're in butterfly now, but recline butterfly. Take one hand to your belly, one hand to your heart. Just feel all the things that have showed up for you on your mat. What's really going on with you today and just focus on honoring all of it. It's okay to feel the way you feel and think what you think. You're designed to feel and think. You're a human. So just let the balance come in by just the awareness of yourself. You're welcome to stay here as long as you like. Thank you so much again. I'm Lauren. Hashtag TIU fall for you. Can't wait to see y'all soon.